Well, the state primary in Michigan just two weeks away now. Election officials there in both Bedford Township and Monroe County say absentee ballots are pouring in. Carla Byron taking a closer look tonight. Trudy Hirschberger is the Bedford Township clerk. She, along with other clerks across the state, are preparing for in-person voting for the August state primary with COVID-19 in mind. We have disinfectant wipes. We have hand sanitizer. I purchase scanners for driver's license that are touchless, so the uh, residents coming through can scan their own driver's license rather than it going back and forth. There are 26,000 voters in Bedford Township, and Urschberger says more people are opting to skip the polls this election. We have so far issued 5,777 ballots, and we have almost 2,500 back. Our normal primary election, uh, the highest we've ever received is around 2,030 ballots. So this is quite a large turnout for absentee this year. Hirschberger isn't sure if that's because of the pandemic or if it's because the Secretary of State sent out applications to every voter. Monroe County Clerk Sharon Lamasters is encouraging people to vote by mail. Every ballot that is mailed out and returned is logged in and we account for every single ballot. So there's no risk if they choose to vote by mail, and um, that would lessen the amount of people that are voting in person at the polls and lessen the risks of, of spreading COVID. Despite Governor Whitmer's order that masks must be worn in public buildings, Lamaster says no one will be denied the right to vote whether they wear a mask or not, but they are strongly encouraged to protect workers and other voters. Carla Byron, WTOL 11.